This video will see how to create a digital menu for your restaurant. First of all, go to buonmenu.com and uh, this is the home page, very clean design. And first of all, I want to show you an example. Okay. Let's see an example menu. Okay, first thing we notice is that uh, uh, is a um, beautiful design, very clean, and we also have a translation uh, in any language. Okay, because this menu is uh, in Italian. For now, we keep it in Italian. Um, you have uh, multiple uh, menus, for example, daily menu, uh, menu à la carte, dessert, wines. Okay, let's click uh, a, a menu, for example. Okay, a menu is uh, divided uh, in different sections. And um, you have, uh, uh, you can add uh, a lot of information about uh, each, um, each uh, recipe. And uh, you can include uh, photos, uh, labels, uh, price, description, ingredients. You can also click to expand the information, but uh, you can also keep uh, things much simpler if you want. For example, let's go to wines. Okay, as you can see, the design is always uh, perfect. And uh, also you can mix, for example, items with photos and items without any photo and the design is always perfect. Um, you, you can include uh, also um, a lot of uh, useful information about uh, your restaurant, a link to maps, for example, uh, direct uh, call if you click, uh, WhatsApp, uh, it's opened automatically, um, and uh, link to your website uh, and much more. Okay. Um, this menu can be seen on desktop, but uh, it's, uh, um, its main target uh, is mobile. So let's see on a smartphone how it looks. Okay, iPhone 6, for example, as you can see, the, the design is perfect on mobile. And uh, on mobile, we also have uh, uh, this uh, bottom navigation which make it uh, make it easier to scroll to scroll a single menu to the different sections uh, for example uh, this menu which is very long you can scroll it you can scroll to sections or you can easily move to a specific uh, section of the menu soups for example rice okay um, yes, bonmenu.com, if you are wondering, is built uh, in Italy, but uh, it's also available uh, in English, so you can, um, you can uh, create it uh, using uh, English. And uh, your menu can be in any language, because uh, your menu only includes your text, so it can be in any language, not only English and Italian. Okay, let's see how to create a, a menu like this. Oh, the menu is also, is also good uh, on tablets, if you are curious. Let's see it on tablet, for example. Um, iPad. Okay, as you can see, uh, the design is always perfect, also on tablet. Um, okay, let's see how to create uh, a menu like this. It's very simple and you don't need the technical skills. Go to create a digital menu in the home page and click at your restaurant. Okay, you need to sign up. Uh, just add a restaurant name, a username email, your email address and the new password. And uh, for now, um, 
it's also free, completely free until uh, May of the next year. Uh, but in any case, it will have um, a very a very affordable pricing later, about uh, 20 euros per month. So you can uh, probably afford it uh, even after this uh, promotion. Okay. Um, now I already have an account and uh, I go to my account. Okay. This is what you see after sign up. And uh, it's a simple uh, interface and uh, it guides you in every step. And it says, uh, first of all, you need to create a menu, for example, daily menu, a la carte menu, fixed price menu, wine list, etc. Okay. Um, for now, we'll add uh, a menu. For example, add menu and uh, we have our menu, for example. Okay, uh, price uh, for now, um, we don't need that because it's only for a daily menu, for example, which has uh, a fixed price. Create menu. Okay, we are inside our menu. Let's add uh, some categories. And it says uh, uh, appetizer, first course, main course. Uh, you can do anything you want. Um, add category. For example, uh, appetizer, for example, can be anything, it can be meat, uh, fish, uh, what you want. Um, create category, okay, we are inside this category, appetizer, okay. Um, now we can uh, add uh, an item. Okay, um, I don't know now, <laughs> example appetizer, okay, um, price, we can add the price, 10, um, 10 euros for example, or you can configure the, um, you can configure uh, uh, euros, uh, dollars, or anything else from the profile settings. So don't worry, here you just need to enter the value. Uh, labels. Labels uh, are a, um, a special uh, tag uh, over, uh, over the recipe. For example, organic, vegan, homemade, uh, gluten-free, can be anything. New product, something that you want uh, to highlight on your product. Uh, we can add uh, an image, description, ingredients. Uh, we can add uh, that or leave it blank. Okay, create item. Okay, and we have this item. Okay. Um, let's go back to the category appetizer. Let's go back to our menu and uh, we want to create uh, another category, for example, so add category. Uh, let's say first course. Create category, okay. And uh, here we can add uh, some item again, okay. Um, see, first course, but for example, I don't know. Uh, spaghetti, for example, price, uh, labels, um, vegan, for example, yes, an image, we'll add uh, an image of spaghetti, for example, I, I strongly recommend to take images of your uh, of your dishes, uh, it's very simple to take great photos with uh, new mobile phones. And uh, you can also um, create the menu first without uh, the photos if you don't uh, have uh, the images. And then uh, 
uh, you gradually add the images uh, when you have the photos because this menu is very simple to edit you can add uh, information photos at any time okay um, description okay uh, ingredients uh, if you want create item it's uploading the photo okay okay and um, now we can add uh, go back to the to the category and we add uh, another item for example uh, pizza uh, price uh, 10 we add uh, the image here we add uh, a description and um, this is a, a long description for example okay and save okay okay and uh, now we can see uh, what uh, we are building but uh, uh, with a uh, preview click on preview with preview we have our restaurant our menu and appetizer with example and uh, the different items however um, we can uh, still improve this uh, menu because uh, we need to complete our profile so that we can add uh, a logo a cover photo description of the restaurant okay uh, let's go back to our admin interface click profile and here you can add a lot of information and photos about your restaurant okay for example uh, a logo okay i'll choose this okay cover photo okay this is just an example and um, you can add uh, your uh, exact address city okay select uh, the country the address and um, here you can add uh, the exact address okay a phone number a whatsapp number and um, a website if you have one um, note that uh, all these um, all these items uh, the phone number whatsapp website they create a button that can be clicked and uh, um, and the user immediately open whatsapp or immediately calls you so it's very direct about is a description of the restaurant um, this uh, Okay, um, we can add additional information, which is the uh, information that is displayed uh, um, below all the menus. Currency, uh, for example, euros, we can add uh, the symbol euros or uh, any other uh, symbol that we want uh, to use. Language, this is very important to select a language because um, this uh, enables automatic uh, browser translations so for example 
if uh, we set uh, this to English. Uh, all uh, visitors of our menu that are uh, not English speakers will see an automatic prompt from Chrome, for example, that asks them if they want to translate the menu automatically. So basically, you just need to select the language here and uh, you get uh, automatic translations in any language. And this happens both uh, in Chrome and uh, will also happen in uh, iOS uh, Safari starting from September. So it's, um, it is really powerful. Uh, we can also change uh, the background color to any color, the background of our menu, maybe you like uh, to use a color. Uh, for now, we'll uh, keep uh, the default. Okay, saved. We go back to the preview. It's already here. Okay, refresh. Okay, we have uh, the new information about uh, the restaurant. Here we can click to go to the map, the cover photo. Okay, uh, it's very simple for now, obviously, but um, now you can go on and complete uh, your, uh, your menu. Uh, finally, you will, uh, you will get uh, a beautiful menu like, uh, like this. As you can see, automatic translations. Okay, and um, so, that's it. Uh, I suggest to go to bonmenu.com and try it. Or you can also, once your, uh, your menu is finished, you can also click share and uh, you have uh, a custom, custom um, URL that you can choose in your profile settings based on your username. And you can share this link uh, on uh, any uh, social network. Uh, you can print it on paper where you want. It's a simple link. And uh, it's also a QR code, QR code that you can uh, download. Just uh, right click and um, save the image. And you can use it uh, as a normal image uh, in any place. And uh, people that scan uh, this uh, QR code goes directly to your uh, specific menu, to the menu of your restaurant. Without uh, any intermediate step, they don't need uh, to download anything, uh, they don't need uh, to uh, install anything, uh, they go directly to your, uh, to your beautiful uh, menu. Okay. And uh, you can, once you have completed your, um, your, your menu, you can always uh, uh, keep it uh, updated and it's very simple because uh, you can change it at any time, add uh, other menus. For example, you can add a daily menu. Okay, we have the daily menu with all the categories, etc. Uh, and um, as you can see, if we add uh, another menu, we have uh, different items uh, in the home, okay? And uh, you can also archive, for example, some items. Uh, for example, let's say that, uh, okay, we don't want uh, the daily menu that, uh, that we have just created, okay? Just click archive, okay? And uh, and the menu disappears, but you can, you still have it and you can restore that at any time. So it's very simple to restore. You can click on archive and it's published again. So uh, it's very straightforward. You can also, you can also edit uh, your menu at any time, move, uh, you can uh, order things. Uh, um, Okay, as you can see, you can archive, for example, categories uh, or uh, archive uh, a specific item. You can move, copy, a lot of um, 
functions that make it easy to reorganize uh, your uh, your menu in different ways and update it without uh, effort okay so go to bonmenu.com and uh, give it a try it's free thanks for watching